What's going down, Clutch? Squat! What up, what up, what up? It's your boy Duck. It's your boy Ross. And this is Clutch going. Boom. Back to you, ladies and gentlemen, with another bitch today. You feel me? All right, we're going to check out beating scammers at their own game uh, super users. I believe this is on, let me check, Vice. So for those who don't know, they're like these call center companies that basically they're target people, especially, uh, I want to say like older people that don't know, mm -hmm. like it's a scam. So say it's a situation where they'll be like, they'll call someone, an older uh, individual and they'll be like, hey, there's a virus on your computer. We we can help you get it off if you give us access, remote access to the computer. And then they'll look at him like, oh, see, this is where the virus is. If you install this and pay this much amount of money, we'll get it uh, on, you know, we'll, we'll be able to save your computer. And people don't realize it's a big ass scam. So they send thousands, sometimes thousands of dollars to these call centers knowing damn well it's all a scam. And they don't know that. Somebody so, said gender people. It's fucked up so basically <laughs> uh is an individual who's actually you know and I'm not this particular person but i've seen videos of people who would target these type of companies and they'll hack into their camera systems and all types of stuff they know their names and they know beat the them address. at their own game they beat them at their own game to the point where they shut down the business entirely because they get spooked so i love seeing these type of vids man. yeah because oh older people man they don't know any better and you already they know, don't know. It's a struggle to deal with technology hell i'm under starting to, i'm starting to understand because the way the stuff be moving and you be trying to figure out like mm -hmm. all the technology and where it's moving and then you got somebody taking advantage of you because they know how to you know they know you don't know well about it that's mm -hmm. yeah special place special place special place so let's check this out should be a good one man ma'am do you think that we are working out here for money do you think that we are going to take your money I don't know how much you bought, but just oh, stop. You're about to be scammed right $3, now. $3,000. And then he right. took my 17000 out of my account. Oh! Scams are still running 17. rampant across the country. He's crying. <laughs> Sir, everything will be okay. I'm going to help you out. How you need to send this money? You're telling me you want me to enter my bank information? I disrupt multi-million dollar scams. And she lost her life savings to an elaborate oh. internet scam. Oh, bro. See, this shit like that. Mm. <sighs> that is crazy, bro. Put them motherfuckers on Snake Island. Let them fucking figure it out. Survive. Survive. I I can't stand people like that, bro. That's fucked up, bro. I can see their webcams or CCTV, and I can actually look these people in the eye as they're scamming people. Oh, like, trust me. The way you were speaking to me, no one in my entire life has speak to me, to me like this. The scammers want to steal money. Talking right. They want to steal all of your money. So i a little nervous. It's almost everything I have. I've managed to close down scam call centers. I've persuaded the police to raid them. I'm Jim Browning. I'm one of the world's best known scam bidders. It's oh, not all hero, heroes wear capes. Wear capes, bro. bro. Facts. And I, like I said, I've seen black some people do like post videos of it. And that shit be funny because they be freaking the fuck out, bro. Cause it's it hit different when someone knows your name, yeah, your information. They know where you stay. They know they're looking at you right now. Like I'm like, bro, that they know what type of music you listening to. I'm telling you, man, that type of that it's cool to see people use their their intellect for good like that, bro. Nah, for sure. Cook these scam niggas, bidding bro. is the art of taking scammers off their scripts. And what I do is turn the tables on those scammers. How can you define me that I'm a scammer? Well, you've been lying to me the whole time. So I reverse the scam. Wow. I was bound to rattle a few people. This is Chris Young, sir. I'm a Windows certified technician. Oh, you're not. I try and keep my identity reasonably secret because no matter what way you look at this, you're disrupting criminal organizations. This is Julia no. calling you from Microsoft. There's certainly thousands of people that I've saved. I would reckon there's well over a million dollars that has been saved. Damn. One woman in New York. You're on the line, okay? Okay. She had actually told the scammers just how much was in her bank account. Oh, Do I have to yeah, tell you? Because we will make sure that you have this amount of money and you don't lose even a single penny out of this. Nobody can take you. 
Okay, at the moment, oh. one million eight hundred and seventy-four thousand. What is it? One million. This nigga had to do a double. How much is it? You said one. One to million. Oh, that is wild. And guess what? They over there. Ooh, we about to. Ooh, we about to run up on them. Ding a ding a. Nobody I, heard that, bro. It's just I heard it. I heard it. Oh, yeah, I ain't hear that, did y'all? No, I'm not. But I was able to call her bank to make yeah. sure that the bank staff were aware that she was being scammed. Unbelievably, some people, even though I speak to them directly and say, look, you're being scammed, they will trust the scammer more mm -hmm. than me. I called up one victim. I don't know what you told my bank. I'd noticed a file on a scammer's computer, which was a wire transfer to oh. Thailand. It was an international transfer that oh. I needed to make. Whatever it was, it is of no concern of yours. She told Damn. me, look, this is none of your business. Scammers have found a new way to try and get your personal information. You are a prime target for the latest Amazon scam. Probably about a year ago, the victim was in Canada. The scammers were pretending to be Amazon. Dear customer. Bro, you know what's funny? I've had someone call me. I'm not trying to make this a story time. But I had someone call me from Amazon. Uh -huh. And they had been calling me. And I was like, you know what? I have time today. <laughs> so I answered the phone. And I'm listening to them. They're like, yeah, um, your account is a it, it seems to be compromised or whatnot um they uh, they had my address or whatnot but i hadn't ordered nothing right so they were basically trying to get me to pay to get my fucking account back and I, at this point i'm like bro you think i'm fucking stupid no I, I, i'm just trying to help you know i'm because at this point i'm I, I stayed on the phone like a few minutes and i was like you think i'm fucking stupid don't you you want me to give up my information i'm not about to pay you for shit and then he got mad. He's like, fuck you, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't work. <laughs> that when the, shit. Oh, my when God. the scam don't work, he cursed <laughs> you out. He said, fuck you, buddy. I was like, yo, fuck you. <laughs> How did he say buddy, though? Was it like buddy or was it like? It was buddy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. That's <laughs> so funny, bro, because he thought. <laughs> I was like, bro, I, I have, I literally was on Amazon while he was talking to me and my account was fine. He said my account was locked out. I'm like, yeah. And I was like, you know, I'm on Amazon right now. And then he was trying to list all the things I've ordered. I was like, I, I haven't ordered nothing. Somebody say, this is why Ross hates gender. <laughs> this is not why I hate gender, bro. Shut the fuck up, bro. Shut the fuck up, bro. <laughs> Oh, but it's just so funny, dog. Like oh, when, my God. When, you, when they actually realize that you you on today shit, then they 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 switch up their phone. I'm like, bro, get the fuck off my phone. So this is a real thing. It's I, only I'm been a few times kid. I've dealt with it, but I like I'm I'll go back. I I get you, and then I don't even like <laughs> I'm the king of not answering. Like if you because. First of all, half these places don't even call you no more. Yeah, like, that's why I was like, Amazon not even finna call I'll your call ass, you, bro. bro. You gotta <laughs> jump through hoops to even fucking communicate with Amazon. Mm -hmm. Then on top of that, blowing up my phone, I was like, all right, yeah, I'm like, bro, if you ain't leaving no voicemail, I ain't even gonna call back. So that means you're not a, a actual because most businesses have to leave a voicemail or something. Uh -huh. if they call, I'm like, oh, you ain't leaving a voicemail. Guess it's not important. <laughs> Guess I'll catch you on another day. I'm the wrong one, bro. <laughs> This nigga say, <laughs> "Fuck you, buddy." <laughs> I was like, "Fuck you, <laughs> bitch!" Get off my phone. We have detected a suspicious activity on uh -huh. your Amazon account. Yep. It just so happened that the day before they tried that scam on me, <clears throat> and I happened to be able to reverse that scam, so I had access to that PC, so I could see and hear yeah, what was going on on that. The scammer wow. made it look as if they zeroed his bank account. And unfortunately, the victim believed them. And oh. what they told him to do was go and buy a gift card. Yep. Honestly, yeah. I know that they already stole all my money in my bank. All, everything I own. So I have to do something to get the money back. Oh, you so know. Just keep the housing. Yeah, we're going to do the refund process. Stupid. Oh, well. 
I knew what his mobile phone said, number oh, was. Well. But of course, he was on the call with the scammer, so I couldn't get through to him. But thankfully, <clears throat> at just the right moment, the cell phone coverage cut out. Hello? Hello, Joe. Please stop. Do not buy gift cards. You're about to be scammed. Oh, I know that, but I already took my money out of no, my he, bank. he hasn't. He edited your screen when your computer was black. Mm. Please, please stop. I don't know how much you bought, but just stop right $3, now. $3,000. If oh. I hadn't made that phone call, he would definitely have lost all of that money. Damn. Hi, ma'am. A very good day to you. This is Olivia Roger, and I'm calling from the security department of Commonwealth Bank. I can only do this for a little while because scammers, as you can imagine, get a bit suspicious. Mm -hmm. So I only really have a very limited opportunity. <laughs> sometimes only get access. Maybe moving them cameras. Yeah, quick. boy. <laughs> but all you gotta do is hit them with their own address. You stay on. Boom, 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 boom. Mm -hmm. Click, click, click. <laughs> That's it. They hang the fuck up. Quick! They out of there. They out of there, bro. Hey, you stay here, don't you? Don't you? Yeah. You like to like to go to your favorite hookah shop on on this uh, app, right? <laughs> yeah, bro, you get the the blue mint mixed with uh strawberry. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's all you gotta do, bro. I don't know what to do <laughs> for maybe one or two hours. Sometimes it can be days or weeks. And over that time, I try to find out exactly who Shake the people the are that are See? doing the scams where they are See what? and if i can they, they ids he gets oh, okay. information and everything i thought you was talking about like the something else. that's that's the thing he's cooking he's he's doing this this is like a sting operation he's fuck uh, like a couple of days he just getting the info getting the info he's cooking saving up oh my god I, I love to see shit like this bro I love to see shit like this, man. Get any more information about other victims, I'll try to pick that up and I pass it on to the right authorities because there's nothing more frustrating than watching them scam victim after victim day after day. Thank you for getting connected to the cancellation department of Norton. My name is Nick Mommy. I deliberately don't say exactly how I do it because scammers then become aware of that. I can't see other computers without them having scammed me, first of all. You just need to know how the scam works. And when he's hung up the phone with me, I can still listen in to calls. Wow. Hey, why are you crying, man? You're a very good man. Why are you crying? <laughs> no, 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 sir. Everything will be okay. Don't worry, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Now promise me you won't cry again, okay? They don't even get a two snapshot shits. of what's going on. If I can see one particular computer, I can see just what's happening on that computer. But if I happen to hit a computer which is owned by maybe like a boss, you can see much more interesting stuff going on. This is Julia no. calling you from Mobile the scam call centers are name. amazingly well organized. I've even seen ones which have performance evaluations. Wow, so one side of the room was scammed, the other side was legit. That's how they kind of hide themselves. That's yeah. crazy. In plain sight. Yep, because I know we're running a legit business, but really five rows of fucking buddy buddies That's... out here scamming niggas, bro. Buddy buddies. Five rows of... Five rows of buddy buddies scamming niggas out their life savings, bro. That's some whole ass shit, That bro. is, bro. That's some whole ass shit. Fuck them, man. There's almost Fuck a language that scam. goes around it. They, they never use the word scams. They use processes. And the people that they steal money from, they're not victims, they're customers. Sadly, about 95% of them tend to be from India. So it's almost a safe Damn. haven for these scammers. Yeah. The very biggest scam call centers that employ hundreds, mm -hmm. the people at the top there will literally make millions of dollars per year. Ooh. You've got to park your conscience at the door, but for a lot of people, sadly, that's okay. The kind of typical profile of a scammer is someone usually who's fairly young, typically fresh out of college. They deliberately target people who are looking for jobs and a way of making quick money. Mm -hmm. The people who work in scam call centers earn the equivalent of a year's salary in just a day or two. 
Damn. I'm monitoring an organization at the moment where the scammers are literally sleeping on the floor of the scam call center. They will typically target people in the USA. So they sleep during the Indian daytime. Nothing ceases to amaze me these days. That I mean, is hey, wild, bro. Hey, I saw you sleeping on the floor last night, man. What's up with that, my boy? Yeah, man. You, you Shirt off and bed? everything. Yeah, you out here scamming niggas. You would think you would have enough money. What are you talking about? Oh, so you, you didn't have a Dr. Pepper next to you? Sleeping Why next to your homeboy? Only, only voice. <laughs> buddy, buddy, buddy. F you, buddy. F you. <laughs> Don't worry, I got a set of individuals that's heading your way. They know where you stay at too, nigga. I have a very special set of skills. <laughs> Didn't know this, but you do know now. You do know now, so. <laughs> I will find you. <laughs> yeah, I know where you at right now. <laughs> Subscribe to him, his channel name is Jim Brown. Hello. He is the king of We are calling scams. you to make you aware about your computer problems, okay? Okay. There was one scam call center in Kolkata in India, which happened to have CCTV. And because I could see their dialing system, I could also listen in to each of the calls. So obviously the scammers give fake names, mm -hmm. but I was able to piece together just by listening to calls, what the fake name was, what the real name was. And I also Ooh. engineered things so that even though they were making outbound calls, I could dial them directly and speak to them so they Duh, thought they were speaking this... to victims but he fact, they were always speaking to me hi sir my name is carolina fernandez i am calling you from believable. the microsoft fernandez oh oh, <gasps> oh he hit him with the hi for you well hit she hit the <gasps> oh, oh, that's... Oh, that's... <clears throat> perfect that reaction what? was perfect. Oh, that is perfect. You hit her with the high, Priya. Mm. Do Last have computer hobble. about this stupid deal. Dog. <laughs> oh, I got you. I know who you are, Priya. You might want to stop this. Would your grandmother approve of this? <laughs> you stupid. Appreciate oh, the, oh, yeah. Appreciate the honey bricks cap. Much love from Central Illinois. Spread love, be love. Hi. Hey, appreciate you, man. Appreciate you, man. She ain't know what to do. I, Who are you? I'm a ghost. Idiot. Tell me my name. You know very well. I know that. Oh, oh I, I know your name. I know everybody's name. Oh. <laughs> they, they all tuned in. They, everybody hit the... Bro, the boy's pulling a chair up, turning around. I know everybody's name. I know where your party at. I know what your favorite drink is. Yeah. I even know your social. Oh, you, I know your personal information. I know all that. I know your bank account, your routing number, all that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. What else, Priya? You, you tell me. You already tell my name. I know. You're Priya. <laughs> I'm a ghost, you see. Oh, yeah. Who is beside me right now? Which side? <laughs> oh. Um, in my left hand side. Um, I think that's Mimi. Oh! <laughs> I had a bit of fun with that. It's not often you get an opportunity to see scammers on their own CCTV and at the same time actually do a little, little trick. She ready to clock out. Right, she, she did. Oh, out. my boy got the technical department. You're talking to Sam. How can I help you? Anyone can be scammed. I even found for a scam myself last year where somebody from Google told me that I had duplicate IDs and I do happen to have two IDs. I went as far as actually being convinced to delete my own channel mm. and it took a while to recover that. So although I didn't fully lose the channel, it was annoying to me, as you can imagine, that somebody actually managed to scam me. Yeah, that's Anyone wild. Anyone can be scammed. The circumstances just has to be right. Mm -hmm. If you're just not on your A game, if you're feeling a little bit off, if something has just convinced you, either by coincidence or anything else, that the person on the phone may be legitimate, then anyone can fall for a scam. Facts, bro. Fuck them. Yeah, bro. No, for sure, bro. Hate that to see was it, the bro. oh you're home early from work gas. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Didn't nah. know you were gonna be clocking out so early today. Fuck those scammers. 
that shit's lame. No, and uh, I hope hope they get they the justice that they deserve, <clears throat> man. People out there scamming older people that don't really realize or not even sure. And it's like, nah, bro. Nigga out here showed a fake screen, like all oh, all your money's gone. When all you have to do is just yeah, check bro. check call on your, your phone. Yo, yeah. Yo, call your bank. But that's he's exactly older, what I, so yeah, they don't even realize they he think, caught oh, you no. in that emotion. Yeah, that I, emotion. So I gotta pay you two thousand plus dollars to get my shit back. Nah, bro, it's fake, bro. All right, all right, man. Hey, appreciate you guys for checking it out. If y'all uh mm -hmm. really enjoyed that video, let us know down below. We can check out some more. So keep yep. on supporting and spreading love, being love, all that good stuff on the road page. No mistakes. Yep. All right. Yep. Catch y'all the next one. Peace out. Already. This bitch is from Houston. If you got a problem, then we got the solutions. And there's no illusion. I made this shit happen. I'm living life lucid. I'm switching my strategies. Now they hate on me cause I'm causing casualties. But why are they after me? Deep inside they know they can't handle half of me.